For this video we are going to look at playing an Irish jig called the Lilting Banshee on the mandolin. I'm not going to explain it note for note to you because you'll get that if you come to me for a lesson or if you uh, subscribe to lessons with me via Skype or FaceTime for example. But we will play the tune a couple of times. I'll play the tune a couple of times at full speed. Then we'll talk a little bit about technical uh, issues when it comes to playing a jig, picking directions and so on, how to get that lovely dancey bounce that you get. Uh, and then I will play the tune a couple of times more steadily so that you can hear how it goes and practice with it as you learn the tune. So as I said, this is a jig called the uh, Lilting Banshee and a couple of times up to speed first of all. Tunes an A minor, so I ended it with a nice A modal chord. Yeah. So, Irish jigs. Um, a jig is a six beat tune. So, most of the stuff that you hear on the radio in the charts is four beat one, two, three, four in a bar. Um, jigs have got six notes in the bar one, two, three, four, five, six. And to give the jig its particular lift, to give it its bounce, we need to emphasize beats one and beats four, so the first of each group of three. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. And if you look at the sheet music for any jig, you'll see that the uh, the notes are usually grouped into groups of three on the sheet music, so you can to give you the idea of playing each group of three separately. Um, so when we're picking a jig, to get that emphasis, one of the things we try to do on a mandolin is to maintain some consistency over how we pick. And while we've talked in the past about always picking down, up, down, up, down, up in order to get speed, with jigs we want to have the idea of picking each group of three notes down, up, down. So it would be one, two, three, down, up, down, and then again down, up, down for four, five, six. So if we do that with the start of the Lilting Banshee, it goes... One, two, three, and then the second three notes, down, up, down, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. And that first down automatically gives the note a bit more emphasis. One, two, three, four, five, six. So as you learn this tune, as you work your way through the tab or the sheet music, try to think that each of the first group of three notes you're going to play with a downstroke. Now it's not always possible or practical to do that on every note, but if you get that idea going that will give your tunes a lot more lift and bounce. The jig is another one of these fiddle tunes where you play part A twice and then part B twice. Um, so if I play the Milton Banshee much more steadily now so that you can hear how it goes.
top again. Now I'm finishing with this A modal chord, which is um, I put my middle finger on the G string, on the top string, on the second fret, and my third finger on the second string down on the second fret. The tune is in sort of A minor. <laughs> 